to AOFC TV. We're here this week with our Redlands United NPL head coach, Daniel Varma. Daniel, welcome. Thanks, Rob. Mate, what a result last Saturday night, way it is. 5 2. Your thoughts on the game? Yeah, the, the boys worked very hard last week at training uh, to implement key tactical aspects that I felt were executed very well on Saturday night in very important attacking moments. So that was very pleasing uh, to watch from a coaching point of view. Two goals to um, Peter Klassen, two goals to Gil Santana, and Rio Amoto finished it off with the fifth. It was, it was good to watch, especially from the spectators' side of things. It was a brilliant game. It's pleasing when uh, when players are able to play in a way that will attract the crowd and people will be able to um, come and come down and enjoy the style of football that we're playing. I was very happy for Peter to get two goals against his old club, my old club as well, and Gil also um, notably with, with two assists and Rio also had a fantastic best on ground uh, performance. Now this Friday night we move away from the, the, the Premiership over to the Kappa Pro Series. Uh, round 3 against Wolves. Um, we played them in the off-season even though you can't read too much into those games. What are you, what are you uh, looking at for that game? Five rounds into the NPL, two into the Kappa Cup and one uh, into the FFA Cup for us. There's a lot of things that are still to work on for our squad that we're developing. So it gives uh, myself and, and uh, the squad a good chance through the week of training uh, to put these into practice with a little bit less pressure than perhaps a league game or an FFA Cup fixture. Nonetheless, uh, a, a very, very solid performance will be expected by myself and by my assistant, Griffin Mansfield. Great. Now, don't forget, folks, it's Friday night, away at Wolves over at Wynnum. We'd like to see as many people down there as we can, wearing red, cheering the lads on. We need you there. You do make a difference to the boys. They really appreciate it. So get there Friday night, 7.30 p.m. I don't think it's going to be live stream, so if you want to watch the boys play, get the weekend off to a good start. Come on down to Wolves and cheer the lads on. And of course, come on you Reds.